All right, today we have a great project vehicle, 1973 Oldsmobile Cutlass Supreme, two-door hardtop. This is a rust-free vehicle. Pretty much everything's there. It's got the dual exhaust. The left side needs uh, some adjusting. It's got the factory rally wheels. The tires are in nice shape, BF Goodrich tires. The front end, this header panel is damaged. I found one for 150. The grills are okay on the right side, but possibly the left, left side needs one. Those are 200. There's no hail on this vehicle. Most of the chrome is there. We're gonna open up the hood as well. The body's really straight, there's no rust. Let's take a look under the door jams. <coughs> the interior is real nice shape. It's got the center shifter. Really clean upholstery. The headliner is nice too. This vehicle has air conditioning. Let's take a look at the 350. We're gonna turn it off and open up the trunk as well. Engine runs strong, the AC is disconnected. Yo, there's no rust ever, anywhere. The, the, the core support is good, but it's this header panel that's damaged. As you can see, this is a one-piece deal. Again, 150. Let's take a look at the, the trunk. The floors are all in real nice shape. Again, this is a rust-free vehicle. It, it could use a fresh coat of paint. This uh, probably was, a, I want to say, maybe a late 70s or 80s uh, repaint. Take a look at the carpet, the seating. Everything's in real nice shape. Again, no rust on the jams. Let's take you off for a quick test drive. solid you got all the keys that came with it start it up this thing starts right off cold or hot 350 strong we're gonna adjust this window this window's down right now uh, let's check out the heat the heat works too radio radios of course the aftermarket one but you know does the job we'll get to that in a second here Transmission uh, goes from gear to gear. Radio works. It's a little bit of noise coming from the left uh, exhaust because it's hanging down. That's an easy fix. We could definitely adjust that here. Well, let's check out the engine and the transmission and see how they shift. has plenty of power you know this this engine's been around for many years very dependable reliable take a look at it drive straight power steering is very smooth the only thing that i can't get to work is the, oh there's the wipers right there the wipers work all the lights work too with the exception of the left side is damaged but that that light is cheap signals work brakes feel great there's no pulsation with them this may have been a daily driver for someone you see, we obtained this vehicle from uh, American Family Insurance, probably because it had that damage up in the front. We're willing to fix it, but at this point, since we just got it in, to get all the parts uh, coming in and to find the body shop, we're willing to sell this vehicle to someone that could handle this project at a reduced price. The gas gauge works too. You got full instrumentation. You got the brake light, generator, you know, back then, alternator was a generator. You got the temperature gauge. This vehicle has uh, pretty much everything that you need. And again, this 350's got plenty of power. Speedometer works. Odometer reads 45, 923. Whether that's a actual reading or if it's flipped already, we don't know. That's a five digit reading. Let's check out the glove box here. Nice deep glove box. You know what's nice is the center shifter here. You have got to lift up on this to get it from gear to gear. The horn works. It's got the Oldsmobile uh, logo here, but you know, this is an aftermarket uh, steering. 
Again, brakes are good, transmission is good, engine strong, there's no leaks. It's got the damage in the front. The muffler needs to get adjusted. We have these other classics. We got a lot of classics that come in. We got this uh, 72 Buick that's got a 455, four barrel. We got a Cadillac that's got the 472. Give us a call with any questions you have. Thank you.